When astronauts first stepped onto the moon in 1969, they stumbled into the history books wearing suits that were bulky and inflexible. Fast forward to 2025 with a major refresh to the wardrobe for the crew of the Artemis III mission to the lunar surface. There's a variety of joints that we've put <clears throat> as well into the lower torso assembly, and this is going to be a huge improvement over the Apollo suits. The Apollo suits didn't have many of these types of joints. Important NASA spent 15 years updating the suits, then turned over the design to the aerospace company Axiom Space to complete the job. A new helmet has improved visibility. The boots are designed especially for moonwalking, and a backpack provides mobile life support. Thermal protection is also a key component as the crew will travel to the moon's south pole where temperatures can plummet to negative 170 degrees Celsius. NASA says an update was badly needed with astronauts returning to the moon and maybe eventually to Mars. We have not had a new suit since the suits that we designed for the space shuttle and those suits are currently in use on the space station. Artemis III will take the first woman to the moon and designers are still making finishing touches to the suits, which are made to fit both male and female astronauts. They say the prototype is dark in color for now, but the outer layer will return to the original white for the Artemis mission, made of mylar and Kevlar to protect the astronauts from extreme temperatures down to the last detail, making sure the crew is dressed for success.